Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I have an Ebony Violet haul for you guys and the owner is C. Moore and um, her wax is paraffin I believe. I don't know if it's blended with anything. I'm pretty sure it's paraffin so there's no cure time on her stuff when it arrives to you. So yeah, so let's just get started with what I got. So the first thing I got is a freebie or a sample. And this one is in Bora Bora and set notes are pineapple, acai berry, mango, passion fruit, and yuzu zest. Now I love summery fruity scents. Those are some of my favorites. So I already know I'm going to like this. And oh my gosh. Yeah, that's, that is so good. Wow. Wow, that is really, really good. Now that is summer in a wax melt. That pineapple mixed with that passion fruit and yuzu zest. It just smells so fruity and so good and it's not super sweet. The pineapple does make it a little bit tart, but that's what I love about this scent. So yeah, this is really good. <laughs> I think I'm. if she brings this back during the summer, I'm definitely going to have to pick some of this up from her. But yeah, Bora Bora. So let's get started. So the first thing I have here is in her um, little owl shapes, which are which look like this. Um, yes, so just a little cute owl, perfect shape for me. And the first scent is in pumpkin firewood. Scent notes are roasted pumpkin. Oh, I don't know how to say that. Guayic wood, star anise, applewood, charred firewood, and black amber. Sounds like a really nice fall scent. Mm. Mm, yeah, that's good. So, this is a really nice pumpkin scent. Um, and it's mixed very well with that firewood. It smells like a very smoky pumpkin. Um, and yeah, this is just the perfect fall kind of scent. I love that like slight woodiness that it adds, but it has some com complexity from the amber and a little bit of spice, not too much, which is good. And yeah, just nice creamy pumpkin. So I really like this one. Okay. So the next one I have here <clears throat> is in Silver Birch and Vetiver and scent notes are Silver Birch leaves, clementine peel, ozone, pine cones, vetiver, sandalwood, and sequoia woods. And this is what it looks like. I love that it has little brown eyes and the owl is blue. Very pretty. And I've been wanting to try like birch scents or vetiver scents because uh, I've never tried them before. So I'm glad I get to try them now. Oh, that's interesting. Hmm. So, this is a very um, outdoorsy kind of scent. I feel like I smell a lot of the pine cones. And it almost smells like there's a little bit of like, like uh, pine trees, but I'm pretty sure that scent is from the pine cones. And it's like woody, but very f like outdoorsy in a fresh kind of way. And I think it's maybe from the leaves and stuff, but... Yeah, that is a really good, nice, woody, fresh, outdoorsy kind of scent. This one is pretty hard to describe, but I, I like this one. I like this one. So the next one I have here is in high maintenance type. And scent notes are patchouli, vanilla, and musk. And this owl has a little pink, pink eye, but a little pink eye with purple. Um, and that's very pretty. I don't know what the type is. Or what perfume or scent it's supposed to replicate but um, yes I love patchouli mm. oh that's really nice so of course the strongest note I smell in here is the patchouli the musk and the vanilla in the background is very nice it complements it very well but the it's not as strong the strongest note is definitely the patchouli but this patchouli is not like a patchouli in an earthy kind of way it's patchouli in a very for the lack of better um, terms like in a very pretty way I guess like it smells slightly perfumey yeah the scent overall is a very like 
it's not super perfumey, but it smells very pretty. That's what I meant by that. So yeah, this is high maintenance type, which I do like. The next one I have here is in Dove type. And uh, scent notes are White Flowers, Rose, Lily of the Valley, and Tunisian Sandalwood. So I'm sure you could tell. It smells like the soap. Mm. Oh. Oh. That's sort of surprising to me. So this has that soapy, clean kind of smell and soapy in like a pretty floral kind of way and now I've smelled Dove soap before um, I don't use it often but my mother used to use Dove a lot and to be honest with you I think this smells better than what I remembered what Dove soap smells like yeah this smells like an elevated Dove soap I don't know I think it smells better and with soap scents I feel like they're very hit or miss they can sometimes have a weird undertone to them but I've got to say there's no weird undertone to this and this smells like a very pretty clean floral kind of scent so yeah I, I actually like this one too so the next one I have here is by the campfire and again I just want to take this owl out because this one looks very pretty So this one has the glitter and um, it's blue on the back, but yeah, so pretty. I love this, but let me put it back in the bag. Okay, so uh, scent, oh, the name of the scent is By the Campfire. Scent notes are blackberry merlot, tobacco flower, whiskey, and cocoa marshmallow on top of crackling sandalwood. Now that sounds very interesting to me, so that's why um, I'm, I'm sort of excited to get this one. But um, yeah, we'll see, because I'm not a, the biggest fan of tobacco flower, so, um, or whiskey for that matter, so we'll, we'll see. Hmm, so... I feel like for me, I smell a lot of that sandalwood. I definitely smell the tobacco flower or the whiskey. I don't know what the difference is between tobacco flower or tobacco, but I smell those notes. This one's okay to me. Not one of my favorites. It almost smells like it has a little bit of blue sugar in there, although that's not one of the scent notes, but I smell like a similar scent or scent in that kind of like scent category at least in here. So yeah, this is uh, by the campfire. The next one I have here, um, or the last one, is Vanilla Birch, and this is Fresh White Birch, Sweet Madagascar Vanilla, and Warm Sandalwood, and this owl has uh, orange with um, white. I got a little smushed, but it's okay. I don't really mind. Mm. Now this one is... Um, sort of cozy smelling it smells very warm and inviting like a very warm and inviting home that fresh white birch um, mixed with that vanilla uh, complements it very well Madagascar vanilla to me at least is a very perfumey kind of vanilla so um, it's not your typical vanilla scent so I smell that in here mixed with that warm sandalwood just makes it sort of inviting kind of scent so yeah this one is vanilla birch so yeah, that is everything from the this very small Ebony Violet haul, and I've got to say, I I do like her stuff. Um, I've I've I have a couple of her um, scents, and they all perform very well for me. So I don't doubt that her stuff will perform well here as well. And I do like the kind of scents that she carries. Um, I'll have to check out her summer line because I love summer scents and I gotta say I think Bora Bora is my favorite scent out of all of them here but um yeah I love summer scents so of course but uh I also gotta say that I did really like this Dove type I normally would I don't know never really pay much mind to like soap scents but I gotta say I like this one I also like high maintenance type and I also like the silver birch and vetiver. I feel like this is a really nice winter kind of scent. So yeah, that is everything 
Uh, thank you for watching. Like and subscribe. And let me know if you guys have ever tried Ebony Violet and what you guys think. But yes, hope you guys are doing well. And goodbye.